Lesson 13. La. Our new word for this lesson is the feminine counterpart of the article le. Francois, can you pronounce the words in the chart for us, please? Le. La. So when you want to introduce a French noun with these articles, you have to pick the article that has the same gender as the noun. In exercise two, for example, we have the noun fia, and so it's being introduced by the article la. It's a feminine article introducing a feminine noun. Then you have the noun garçon, and that is being introduced by the masculine article le. See, the gender of the article and the gender of the noun have to match. This is what we call, in uh, languages, we call this agreement. They have to agree with one another in gender. And as I was mentioning a few lessons ago, uh, this is one of the reasons why, when you learn a new noun, you have to memorize what gender that noun is, so that you know what article to put with it. And later on, we'll have even more reasons for why you have to know the right gender. But for now, this is a perfect example of why you need to know the gender of every noun.